So do y'all want to go into our top five games? Uh, our, our personal yes. top five games? Okay. Yes, yes. Let's go to our personal top five games. Yeah. All right. So uh, yes. well then uh so yeah, you can go first, B. All right. So of course I'm gonna start from five and, and work my way to number one. <laughs> Excuse me. So at number five, I got Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Shredder's Revenge. Mm-hmm. At number four, I have Dying Light 2. At number three, I have Horizon Forbidden West. At number two, I have Sifu. And of course, y'all heard me. Y'all, y'all know I've been saying this. It's damn near the first two hours of the game came out. God of War is my number one. It's my game of the year for the year 2022. Okay, Kev, what you got? All right, so I don't like the rest of these ain't in order except for the last two. So I got multiverses in there. I got Shredder's Revenge in there. And then what else did I play this year that was new? Y'all know I'm playing my new games. Uh. I'm, you know what? I'm gonna put Gotham Knights on there, and because I've been having fun with it. Okay, I know it got bad reviews. I Uh-oh. still been having fun with it when I play co-op. I'm telling everybody, buy it on sale and play it co-op. It's not that bad when you play it like that. And then I'm gonna say 2K and God of War Ragnarok is my number one. So it was two 2K second and God of War number one. Okay. All right, so for me, um, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go from bottom to the top. So number five, I'm going to have multiverses. Number four, Horizon Forbidden West. Number three is TM and Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles: Shredder's Revenge. Number two, Sifu. Number one, God of War, Ragnarok. I just, I just realized I, I didn't say Sifu, and I would like to apologize. I was, I was wow, born. Bro, I was about to get. I don't know bro, what I'm doing wrong. Seafood, I, I didn't want to cut. I didn't, didn't want to cut Granddad off, but I, boy, I was about to get you. I was about I'm to get you, Kevin. Hey, I was about to off, get you. Take off, take off, um, multiverses and put Sifu in there. I'm fucking tripping. You wild, bro. Now I'm multiverses would be there too, but yeah, because at first. I'm, I had, Tripping. I had, at first I put the Cuphead DLC, which is pretty much a full game to me, even though it's a DLC, but then I thought about Multiverses and Sifu, I was like, nah, neither one of them going nowhere, so that one had to, that one moved to number six, uh, and Horizon, and Horizon was like my first big game of the year, loved it, still love it. Yeah, I would, and I'd then, like to formally apologize, I'm fucking tripping. Yeah, but you know, we all, the streets know Sifu, Sifu was hot, bro, Sifu, I think Sifu, like, Surprised a lot of people how how well it was received or how good it was because people probably thought it was gonna be like you know I mean some people thought it was gonna be good but some uh, people probably like I knew that man I, I, I had, the, I had the a trailer it was gonna be bro, the trailers yeah. alone let trailer. it no yeah. but I think people was like they uh, I guess it lived up to the hype because everybody was hyped up about it and then when it came out it was hey, it was it was like Granddad man. what was it it was lived up to the hype initially and then a couple months later we was like I right, now well, it's yeah, about they, time they, for y'all to drop something new. They did, right. They, they dropped the ball with the momentum, though, for real. They should have yes. had yeah. something, yeah. something else come out, for sure. Hey, hey, Granddad, give me your three, four, and five again. Three, four, and five? Yeah. Uh, five was five was multiverses, four was Horizon, and three was... What's my three? Hold on, let me move this. Three was... See, no, two was Sifu, one was God of War, three was Shredder's Revenge. Was it? Yeah. It's you. It's... No, I just forgot. You I said, what? Me? Like, nigga, it's your list. I, I was supposed to tell you. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me pull it up. Let me pull it up. Because I had it. I had it. Then I just I took it off. So, Horizon, number five. Horizon, number five? Yeah, Horizon was my number five. Okay. No, no. Fo- no. Multiverse. Multiverse. This man here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm oh, my God. Up. I'm fucking up. No, the reason why I'm asking is because I'm tweeting out all of our uh, top gotcha. five. Multiverse is number five. Horizon okay. number four. Okay. Shredder's Revenge. Number, number three. three. Sifu. And number two. Number two. Gotta War. Gotta War number one. There you go. Okay. All right. This man here, boy. 
But yeah, but speaking of Sifu, so I know B, you was frustrated with them not releasing no nothing like substantial. Bruh. And when they well, so they've they had their, their roadmap of everything that's releasing, and they don't have no new content like dropping until next year. Next year they're adding something called arenas mode. We don't know what that is, but it's gotta be some different gameplay, I'm assuming, nah. if it's called arenas mode. So Maybe you maybe you're going against other people, or like I, like I suggested when it first came out that you can like fight other people. Maybe that's what that is. But at this point too, we need another. We need an actual expansion to go along mm-hmm. with the game. We need another full blown mm-hmm. expansion of the story, um, something, because um, that game's too good to just let it stop at that point. So I agree. Uh-huh. All right, uh, Kev, give me your give me your five real quick so I can make sure I tweet it out. I texted him to you already, but I can. Oh, you did. Oh no, 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 no. Okay. No, no, no. no. You get. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah. So they go our top. It's that's our top five. So I I already know. My 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 top five favorite personal favorite video games is not going to match my PlayStation year rap. Oh yeah, my (laughs) rap. You know what I'm saying? Like that. That's never the case. Uh, for the for the wrap ups. Um, Kev, is this in order? No, it the order doesn't really matter on mine as long as you. Put oh, okay, gotcha, 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 first. gotcha, gotcha. Nothing gotcha. that really matters. Gotcha. Okay. Um. Yeah. So, uh, Granda, you want to share them? Share them my uh, wrap up, my PlayStation wrap up. Yeah. So, we'll, so we're gonna actually show y'all uh the actual wrap ups. Uh, yeah. Make sure we out of here because you know she was acting up. Here we go. So we're gonna show bees first. Uh, so we're gonna pull it up. So what's cool is we'll just walk through the whole process. So. We're going to start off with the total play time. This is for BZ430, y'all. So B's total play time this year was 936 hours. This man was playing, playing. So uh, 655 of those hours was on the PS5, and you had 282 on that musty-ass PS4. All right. <laughs> that's, because of, that's, that's because of division. Yeah. Uh, that's because of division. But, you know, you play 668 hours locally and then 268 hours online. And you play for 293 days this year. All right. Uh, let's see. Let's go back to your dashboard. Go to the next section. Top games. So your top games. All right. You played 33 games in general this year. But your top five, Tom Clancy, The Division 2. That's not surprising. Yeah. And yeah. You played that for 263 hours. The 20, 28% of your playtime. And then the, ne- the number two game was Destiny. Mm-hmm. Destiny 2. Also not surprising. Yeah, because yeah. of Witch Queen. Yep, yep, I was playing that a lot. Yeah, 226 hours on that. That was 24% uh, percent of your playtime. Number three was Horizon, Forbidden West. 89 hours logged into that, 9% of your playtime. And next, following that is God of War Ragnarok. 85 hours of God of War with 9%. And then the last one is NBA 2K23 with 67 hours and 7 yep, That's not surprising because the grind. The grind is real in 2K, bro. The grind, the grind is, is real. real. And the grind uh, is real. So your favorite genre of this year was role-playing games, the RPGs, with 264 hours and two different RPGs played, uh, God of War and uh, Horizon, most likely were those games. Trophies. Let's see what kind of trophies you got up out of here. So you ended up with 228 trophies. New trophies. You got zero platinums, nine golds, 37 silvers, and 182 bronzes. All right. So, no platinums, B. No, no, no platinum. I thought you said you 100% of God of War. You lying? No yeah, platinum. I did. I meant, I meant, you I meant, then you would have, you would have platinum in. Well, you ain't, okay, you got 100%. Well, no, right you right know, right. I didn't, I didn't do all those like kill. Ah, know, okay. 100. Okay. That's the ones I didn't 100%. But like the maps, I did everything. I got gotcha. all the damn everything. Gotcha. Everything. And then your PlayStation Plus, okay, so as far as you using PlayStation Plus this year, uh, you had access to 833 games, and I think you only played, uh, twenty. you added 24 of those games. 24 games, uh, with the division being the top one that you played, 124 hours spent on PlayStation Plus games. And that's B's, uh, that's B's wrap-up. So how do you feel about that, B? You feel good about the numbers? Yeah, I mean, I... I guess. I mean, like, like when I when I when I saw when I saw the top five, I was just like, oh yeah, like like it, it. Nothing surprised my five when I saw the hours of those games that I played. I was looking at it like, okay, that's not surprising because as much as I love seafood, if it would have had more content, right? You then you know, I would have put you know, I would have put more. I definitely have more hours than that. 
You know what I'm saying? But like once I beat the game, my thing was like, okay, let me beat the game. Let me 100% beat the game. Like let me beat the game by not killing all the bosses. I did that. You know what I'm saying? Like I did everything. I made sure that whole map that was in the little room was clear. Like mm-hmm. I did all that yeah. shit. You know what I'm B- saying? B2 even, was going hard on season even, when the first even, came out. I even remember. did a speed run. Yeah, I even did a speed run on that shit. I think I beat it like I think I, I went live. I think I beat it in like 52 minutes. It could have been better because I was fucking up. But yeah, so like I was, man, Sifu, it's just not, a lo- it's not enough content to, to put in the hours that was shown in my yeah. PlayStation wrap up. But yeah, I was playing. Yeah, I, like I said, that five don't represent my personal top five, my favorite games of this year. So yeah, I just know the games I was putting in work. Like, you know, it's crazy. That's what's up. All right, Kev, we're going to go with you next. So we're going to show Blood Baths uh, PS wrap up. So we're yep, going to start off yep. with this total play time. Kev was out here. 927 total hours. All right. So 767 of them hours was on that PS5. 160 were on the PS4. Uh, 827 were played locally. 100 were played online. You, you played for 241 days. All right. So top games. So you played 35 games. All right, 35 games for Kev. It's That's top. a lot for That's me. A lot. That's a lot. So your top number one, Apex Legends. All right, so Kev was out here shooting shit up. 161 hours logged in on Apex, 17% of his playtime. Number two. That sounds accurate. Not surprising, NBA 2K23. 156 mm-hmm. hours I, on that. I, I'm arm. surprised that's not one. I'm Me actually too. surprised that's yeah, not yeah, one. Yeah, yeah. I'll because, one oh, the, the game only came out like two, like in August. And you've been playing the fuck out that damn game, bro. <laughs> right. Every week. Every right. week you always say 2K, 2K. Two, right. Like yeah, I play always, it. You don't say two, you don't say Apex as much as 2K. You but always Apex, say I had, but I had seven months of Apex already right. built up before the new 2K came out. Yeah. So well, I guess, yeah. I guess. Apex is yeah. one of them games that you just play it, you don't realize how much time you put into it until exactly. after the fact. So yeah, it's one of them types of games. But uh yeah, so number two was 2K23 with 156 hours and 16% playtime. And right behind it was 2K22. <laughs> this man said, <laughs> this man said no, Yeah, still, that's crazy. You still gonna get this work. We still gonna get this, we still gonna get this hoop game up, bro. That was 145 hours and 15% of his playtime. <laughs> <laughs> this man said, fuck. This man said, no, we still hooping. I don't give a fuck had, what year it is. We still hooping, nigga. This man had 2K22 and 23 on his shit. He said back to bro. back. He said back to back. <laughs> and then he said, no, we still, it's still 2K. He said, but we think it's in the rain. <laughs> Bro. He said, two, is- that, so number four was WWE 2K22. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, this, 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 this 2K sports is getting all your money, nigga. And your time. They're the, they're the only people making sports games, bro. <laughs> like, it's my only EA, option. EA, help. Please. <laughs> EA, Please. EA, help. No, so 80 hours on uh, 2K20, WWE 2K22 with 8% of the playtime. And then topping uh, around at number five was God of War Ragnarok, 43 hours and 4%. Because he ain't beat the game yet, y'all. But yeah, 43. Nope. So, you, so you about, you about, I say you about over a little bit over halfway there. So, well, yeah. Uh, and your top genre was first person shooter, obviously, because your number one was Apex. Because of Apex, yeah. yeah. If it wasn't for Apex, it would have been sports games, oh, apparently. Def- definitely. 174 hours logged and four games played, 17 trophies earned. All right. Let's go into your trophies now. Let's go de- in depth with the trophies you had. 378 trophies, Kev. Very nice. Uh, no platinums, but you had. I've, I've never platinumed anything. I said he never platinumed. He never, he never sold a million copies. Not a single platinum. Never. But he does got 16 gold things, 16 gold trophies, 56 uh, silver trophies, and 296 bronze trophies. All right. You know, and your uh, I I forgot to say this for B, but his uh latest trophy was come up. It's from uh God of War Ragnarok, so yeah, all right. And then going into your PlayStation Plus, all right. So you had thirty five games added from PlayStation Plus this year, Kev, and you spent forty one hours online. And your top online multiplayer game from PlayStation Plus was, of course, NBA. Well, not using PlayStation Plus was NBA Two K Twenty Three, which is not surprising mm-hmm. at all. All about that 2K life. All right, so yeah, so so that's Cavs numbers, though. Respectable, respectable. Look, so I guess it's just that, so funny that it's just like it just it was just the 2Ks. It was just a, a line of them, right? Like, okay. 
Look, you dedicate you dead when you say 2K, you bought that life. You ain't lying, bro. You you are yeah. out of your word with them 2K lives. But uh yeah. yeah, I mean, I'm not surprised by your list. Like I said, yeah, you always got the 2K going, you always got the Apex going. So, you know, it's um so it's a solid list. It's it's, it's a very Kev list. I, I yes, no surprise, absolutely. no surprise, no surprises on that list at all. All right, y'all. So I'm gonna preface my list, y'all, by saying I'm sorry, okay. I didn't have the time this year. This year's been a little wilder for me. Like I ain't, ha- I ain't had the time to grind like I this wanted to. This man said, "I'm sorry." <laughs> so I ain't putting up the numbers that these two gentlemen above me have put up. But I'm gonna tell you right now, I, I, I'm still out here gaming. All right, so we are gonna go ahead and go to my wrap up and uh, see what I done done in you know in in, in my uh, time here in 2022. You know, so total hours played. I apologize. Six hundred thousand, six hundred seventeen hours, y'all. Ain't a thousand. Hey. If it ain't a thousand, it ain't official. It ain't, it ain't official. It ain't a thousand. Bro. Look, it ain't official, bro. bro. I've been slacking, bro. Look, I, I went back to work this year. I went back to traveling. I've been doing a whole bunch of things. So yeah, bro. Like I ain't had time to, to grind it out like I did last year. But six hundred seventeen hours, five hundred twenty-one was on the PlayStation Five. Ninety-six was on the PS Four. Uh, 576 hours played locally. Forty-one played online. And I played for two hundred and thirty-five days. All right. So let's take it back. One of my top games. So I played 28 games this year. A little light, but number one game, Apex Legends, at 172 hours logged, 27 percent of my play time. I was I was heavy on Apex this year, y'all, because that was yeah. well, that was mostly the game that I had time to really sit and play, like like, like get a couple games in and go, because I really didn't have time to really sit and play games like I wanted to. But yeah, you can always cut on Apex and do a couple rounds. So yeah, that's that's definitely expected. Number two. Returnal. I was still, I was still in that Returnal life. That look when they dropped that DLC and the uh, the Tower of Sisyphus, I was in that thing a lot. So seventy six hours on Returnal, twelve percent of my playtime. Love Returnal. Um, I think they're gonna have some more Returnal content coming out soon too. But I'm I'm, I'm ready for a sequel. So hopefully we get a Returnal too because I'm here for it. Uh, number three, Horizon Forbidden West, sixty seven hours long, and I played. Uh, 11% of my playtime was that, with 68, 68 hours, 68 hours, I should say. Number four, it just came out, but I've been putting in work. God of War, Ragnarok, 46 hours logged in, 7% of the playtime. And look, it's on here, so you can't say I ain't been trying. NBA no. 2K23, 43 hours on 2K. It's low. It ain't, it ain't, it ain't Kev numbers, but I was there. I was there. I was there. <laughs> Six percent of my playtime went to two K twenty three. I'm gonna do better in twenty next year, y'all. It's gonna, I'm, I'm gonna. You gonna have to. I'm gonna look, do better, y'all. Look. It's gonna be. It's gonna be a little bit higher on the list next year. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try. Nah, he gonna. He gonna have to, y'all. His yeah. his 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 position is on the line at this look, point. Oh, look, look, whoa, oh, whoa, 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 not whoa, on the whoa. line. Wait, calm down. We now. can't. No, we we can't. We can't. We can't drop him from the team, obviously. But you know what I'm saying. He just might have to get moved to a different spot somewhere. Look, look, well, we we, 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 we moving. We, we moving me. We moving me to the to, to the four. We moving me to the four. We gonna see how that works out. But next. Year we're mm-hmm. gonna do better. All right. Favorite genre, uh first person shooter, because of Apex, obviously, 174 hours, three different games, eleven trophies earned. All right, so let's go to my trophies. All right, so I got 271 new trophies this year. I got one platinum, y'all. I sold a million Dang. copies, and I know where that platinum came from. That platinum was from Horizon. I platinum Horizon. That's what it was. Oh wow, um, you, you was all in. I was in there, I told you. Uh, 18 gold went to 18 gold and then 54 silver and then 198 bronze and then better together. That was the last trophy I got, uh, from God of War Ragnarok. I just beat that game. Uh, okay. And then let's go to PlayStation plus. All right. So I added 10 games from PlayStation plus this year and only spent 11 hours playing PS plus games and top online multiplayer was actually 2k 22, not 23. Mm, that's not surprising, you know. But that's my wrap up, y'all. And I'm gonna go back to B's real quick so I can see what his um his uh latest trophy was. We didn't we didn't say that. So his latest trophy was the True Queen from God of War Ragnarok. And I think that's when you beat uh the the Valkyrie Queen, right, B? Mm-hmm. Yep. Yep. So yeah, so that was B's latest trophy as well. So yeah, yeah. Ass. So those were our uh, PlayStation wrap ups. Uh, you know, we were out here playing games. Of course, B and Kev got more time in. They got they they beat me by about three hundred hours, both respectfully. Um, but we've been out here, you know, trying to keep our gaming chops up. So hopefully next year I'm gonna put up better numbers, y'all. I'm gonna try next year. I'm I'm gonna tell you right now. I'm saying it now. I'm gunning for a thousand hours next year. I'm gunning for it. Okay. So 
So that's what it is. So, so, so we gonna we gonna we gonna up the stream. And I and I tell you why. Also, I ain't been I, my, my numbers are low because I didn't stream this year a lot at all. Mm. Last year I was streaming a lot, so I had more hours in the game. So now that I'm gonna be back to streaming and doing the stuff I need to be doing, the numbers are gonna show. So look out for that for the for the resurgence in 2023. Look, I've been traveling. I've been back and forth to New York. I've been doing all this other mm. stuff, bro. I ain't, bro. I, I got a kid to raise, bro. I got Christmas mm -hmm. and birthdays to worry about planning, bro. Come on now, come here. Let man. alone it, the album. You know, the album. Hey, I'm in the album. album. I'm in the studio every other day, Mick doing, oh, going over mix. I got a lot going on right now. I'm sorry. Let team. alone. I'm sorry. Let alone. I'm sorry, team. Don't you? Don't you let say? Alone. Don't you say <laughs> nothing? Don't you yo, say yo, nothing? Yo, stop. Yo, other business that you got going on. Knock it off. Knock it off. Bruh.